Hey freaks and geeks, how are you all going tonight? Today, whatever time you're looking then. Uh, for this challenge, all I'm going to be doing is a bit of an air show. This old uh, XR2 Ravenstar. So I'm going to pull off a few high G turns. I don't know. Do an upside down tr trick down the runway here, but uh, I'll be uh, doing it all from virtual cockpit. And I'm thinking about putting a camera, I don't know, maybe, maybe that tower there, I'm guessing. So this will probably be a two-part series. Uh, but I'll be doing it from the virtual cockpit. Okay, copy, uh, overnight. Ah, which is in there. Router, KFX, pop, but I'll have to use uh, what I call we'll this KFX. main page to do a few things uh, first. Turn the APUs on and the uh, hydraulics and all that sort of shit. So in order to have a uh, recording of it, apart from what we're doing at the moment, so I've got to record it from uh, Orbiter and then after I do this from the virtual cockpit I'll uh, do another video, maybe the same video, not sure yet but maybe another video, just a spectator view of it um, so basically what I want to do is try and hover it on its tail as close as I can to the ground to start with, um, but she weighs a lot at the moment, she's got a lot of fuel in it so yeah, I mean it's built to go into space. So she's fully weighted. So what I'm going to do is just do a few tricks upside down. Like I said, don't know what I'm going to do yet. A couple of stall turns. Who knows? Anyway, what we're going to do is just enjoy the uh, the ride. So me virtual copies this one. This is all I'll be using throughout the whole video. Apart from when I have to take off and turn some shit on and off. Steve, go ahead on out of uh, two. Speaking of which, I better start recording this. So this will be our uh, camera view on Orbiter. I'll, I'll call it Air. Air Show. Fast. Fast car 351. So yeah, later on I'll... Uh, go back to the recording and put the camera somewhere hell I can zoom in and out and put the camera where I like but you'll get to see what I'm doing but uh, back to what I was saying before I have to uh, turn some stuff on here so I'll turn some strobes on that's just our lighting APU which controls my uh, elevators and ailerons which in one of my previous videos I subscribed well, the good news is that so Pedro is running too. Um, hey, listen, Jeff, uh, can That's you me RCS. me on the other hand? So basically, everything's ready to rock and roll. So I've got ailerons, I've got me thrusters, which will allow me to basically do stall turns and still drive it. You know what I mean? So I can go up and down. All that good stuff. Discovery Houston for playback. You've got a good surround sound system. Turn your subby up for this one. That'll test her out. But yeah, so that's the uh, game of play for this video, fellas. And girls, ladies and gents, whoever's watching. So without further ado, going to my virtual cockpit. Let's have some fun. Let's rock and roll. I'll burn some bloody fuel off. Straighten her up a bit there. V1. Rotate. So I'll have to back off the throttle here, like here, Wheels just to, uh, otherwise the gear we're going to fail. Then I'll pull her into some tricks straight up the bat. Do a flyby over this little lost. NASA tower here. Warning, gear is up. Goes back from the Apollo days, this one. Warning, gear is up. 100. You're going to hear a lot of warnings, wing stress, gears up. It's just telling me, you know, I shouldn't be, I shouldn't be flying like the way I am. Yeah, worry, fucking worry about that though. So I'll back the throttle down a little bit. Just cause I can. Warning, wing stress. There's wing stress. That means I'm pulling a few G's. For a photo TV, please. Going to me other cockpit, I could tell you how many G's to be exact. I don't know. I reckon I should put the uh, camera here 
here somewhere maybe. Doesn't matter. I can change that shit later on. But just for shits and giggles we'll do a fly pole past this tower here. Pull her up. Cut the throttle, we'll try to do a stall turn here. Yeah, this uh, this thing will fail on me if I pull too many G's. So there's our airspeed. Slowly cruising down. I'll do a hammerhead near, which is a stall turn. I'll yaw it straight down. Mindful, I've still got a heap of juice, so I'm going to have to uh, pull out right about now, I'm thinking. Just trying to spot where I'm going to put this camera for the best view. I'm right on the edge of stalling it. Now I'm picking up a bit of speed, that's all good. Thanks for checking, we can confirm. Warning, wing stress. Warning, wing stress. Warning, gear is up. Surface here, eh? Warning, gear is up. Forty. Warning, gear is up. It's like a bomber run on an F-111. Uh, again, back off on me throttles. Yaw it around. Back on the burners again. Pull a heap of G's. Basically, do a a roll here or a loop, stall it. We're basically heading 
you just follow that's where we're heading is. So we're sort of doing a flat spin. Let's try that. Do a bit of a flat spin. Yeah, it kind of worked. Still got a lot of weight. Let's see how many rotations we can do. We'll fucking start flipping the nose out. Yeah, it's probably enough being this heavy. Mock one, warning, wing stress. Four thousand, warning, wing stress. Three thousand. Warning, wing stress. Two thousand. Warning, wing stress. Do I fly stress. over the beach? See if we can see any triggers here. Yeah. Clear to land. Warning, wing stress. One warning, wing stress. Eight hundred. Seven hundred. Six hundred. And five. Jeff, thank you for working four, with us. So without a doubt, warning, wing hundred. stress. Warning, gear is up. One hundred. Warning, gear is up. Fifty. Nice strikers. Might be time to see if we can uh, hover it on its tail at the runway. What do you reckon? Fifty. Warning. The gear is up. Warning. Wing stress. So kill the throttles. Get a little bit of altitude. Find our runway over there. Uh, not sure how much weight I've got left. It's handling a little bit better than it was, so we're losing a bit. Losing a bit of weight. APU fuel 90%. That noise you can hear is me thrusters, plus me other ones, and that, but mainly me thrusters. Okay, and if Thomas is still listening, which will allow me to uh, do my stall DT here. After the Moscow part, put some mains on. Be expecting a special call. One thousand. See if I can. Nine hundred. Eight hundred. Put it on its tail. Seven hundred. Six hundred. Five hundred. Four hundred. Three hundred. Warning. Gear is up. One hundred. Warning. Gear is up. Radio. Let's try it. That's my vertical airspeed, that's my altitude. So we're basically going backwards now. The one that we're looking for, that we would like you to use, are the two heart rate monitors that you so guys can see that. are using for your normal exercise on board. It will be And we think that those two HRMs are in the ergometer bag next to the shuttle ergometer. Did you find anything yeah, in there? still got a lot of weight. You can see how... Uh, cloud there, so I'm going to just get out of this for a minute, because uh, I can't really see the horizon, but I know it's getting low. Let's see if I can uh, flip it around now. Still low. Cool. Give it max thrust forward. We're stalling big time. That's okay. You are cleared to land. So it worked. Like, I hovered it there for a minute or two. Well, a couple of seconds at least, I thought. Warning, wing stress, 500. Might look alright in the replay, I'll we'll do another one. Find where the runway is. Hey, your gut's going. I'm about to do a fucking heap of inverted turns and stuff. Just for shits and giggles. Right, so that's where I'm thinking about putting the camera. Doesn't Six really hundred. matter. Just see me. 500, 400, 300. Warning, gear is up. Right, another tall one.
Airlock station mark, we copy. There's our 90 degree, roughly. It's hard to tell on our uh, virtual cockpit. But they're going down. There's our controls. You are clear to land. That's usually a sign saying I better get some bloody height. <laughs> go to the moon. But yeah, we're actually 9 degrees, we're sinking 14 meters a second. The fact that, uh, tomorrow you will Going by my altitude, hour we're a thousand, thousand feet up. Well, a thousand. Yeah, a thousand K. A thousand meters. 1,900. There's 900, there's 8. Well, you can hear it. 700. We're basically hovering on our bum. You can't really see it from here, but that's our 90. That's our altitude. That's our meters a second. So we're doing it. Let's see how low we can go. Because that doesn't always equate to where the hills and shit are. Up. I reckon that's probably gonna do us. Warning. Because Gear it's a fairly long ship. So let's launch this sucker. We'll call that done. We'll do a uh, roll on the way out. Then we might do a uh, Mark 1 turn. I should look alright in the replay. Uh, like I said, it's just a matter of figuring out where I want to put the uh, camera. So you guys, uh, leave a comment below what you want me to do next as far as challenge-wise challenge goes. Either I can do it or I can't. Uh, picture doing it blindfolded, if you will, like, uh, just say go to the moon without any instrumentation. I know I can go to the moon, I've, I've done it before with all my instrumentation and that, but uh, it's easy done, if you want me to do that, I can do that too. Well, let's see if we can do an inverted flight here. So I'll put her up to about uh, 50. Uh, get some attitude. Well, there's our fuel low a bit. So what I have to do, people, is uh, transfer a bit of me scram fuel to me mains, just so I can keep flying. It's not ready to land yet. So I'm just gonna have to go to my uh, main page. Or oh, I can just land it. Yeah, bugger it. Let's just land now. Really, that's cheating. I said I'd do it from the uh, cockpit. 2000. So I'll get a dead stick. We'll see if we'll land a dead stick. There'll be another challenge. That's our mark one. Oh, there's our main fuel. So we're basically dead stick. So I need to get a bit of altitude now. Come in for a landing. Copy that. We don't think so, but we'll let you know if uh, we solved our OSTP update problem. I've got no throttle whatsoever, guys. So dead sticking it. That was pretty cool. That's another challenge. Dead sticking it just off the edge of the runway there. 
You are clear to land. It's a bit annoying that master alarm. I can cancel it if I go. Uh... One thousand nine hundred, eight hundred, seven hundred. Okay, I'm gonna pull up short. Five hundred. Not a. Check you down. Warning. Gear is up. Two hundred. Gear down and locked. One hundred. Seventy-five. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Six. Three. Gears down. Fuck yeah, made it. Don't know where we brace her. Basically, that noise is just me pulling back on me thrusters, Again, trying to pull her up. Before we crash into those bloody uh, we'll see here. Uh, from the ground, is it working well for you? One hundred knots. Oh, we're just gonna make it a link. I could go back to my uh, main page and stop it, but like I said. We're fully uh, virtual cockpit. And we lived. We'll stop. Alright. We'll stop. So I'll get out of my uh just so we can System reset. piss that off. Turn everything off. You can have both switches on at the same time, and at this time, we'd like you to take the aux power switch to the on. That's position. it. I hope you enjoyed it. Now, we didn't do a lot of high-speed passes, but uh, all in all, we lived for it. We uh, ran out of fuel coming on for a high-speed pass, but uh, managed to pull it around and save it. So that's uh, part one of the video, and uh, we'll do the next one shortly. Thanks for watching, guys.